ವಂದೆ ಗುರುಪದ್ವಂದ ಭಕ್ತವಿಂದಸಮನ್ವಿತ ಶ್ರೀಚೈತನ್ಯ ಪ್ರಭು ವಂದೆ ನಿಂದಸಹೋದಿತ ಶ್ರೀನಂದನಂದನ ವಂದೆ ರಾಧಿಕಾಚರಣೋದಯ ಗೋಪೀಜನೋ ಸಮಯುಕ್ತ ಬಿಂದಾವನ ಮನೋಹರ ವಾಂಚಾಕಲ್ಪತರು ವಶ್ಯ ಕಿ ಪಾಸಿಂದುವಚ ಪತಿ ಪಾವನೆ ವೈಷ್ಣವೇಭ್ಯೋ ನಮೋ ನಮಃ ಮೂಕಂಕರೋತಿ ವಾಚಾಲಂಗ ಪಂಗುಂಗ್ಲಂಘಯತಿ ಗಿರಿ ಯತ್ ಕಿ ಪಾತಮಹಂಗ ವಂದೇ ಪರಮಾನಂದಮಾಧವ ಬೃಂದಾವೈ ತುಳಸಿ ದೇವೈ ಪಿಯಾ ವೈ ಕೇಶವಸ ಸ್ನಭಕ್ತಿಪದಿ ದೇವಿ ಸತ್ವತ್ವೈ ನಮೋ ನಮಃ ನಾರಾಯಣ ನಮಸ್ಕೃತ್ವ ನರಂಚ ನರೋತ್ತಮ ದೇವೀಂ ಸ್ವರಸ್ವತಿ ವ್ಯಾಸ ತೋ ಜಯೋ ಮುದೀರ ಸಂಕೀರ್ತನೆ ಕೃಷ್ಣ ಕಥೋಪದೇಶ ಗೌರೀಯ ಪಾತ್ರಶ ಪ್ರಕಾಶನೆ ಚ ಸದಾನುರಕ್ತ ಗುರುಭಕ್ತಿಯುಕ್ತ ಭಕ್ತಿ ಪ್ರಮೋದಾಕ್ಷ ಜಗೋದ್ವರನ್ ಧೈಯ ಸದಾ ಪರಿಭವಗ್ನ ಭವಿಷ್ಠದೋಹಂ ತೀರ್ಥಾಸ್ಪದ ಶಿವ ವಿರಂಚನು ತಂ ಶರಣ್ಯಂ ವೇತ್ತಾತ್ಯಹಂ ಪಣುತಪಾಲ್ಲಭವಾಧಿಪೂತ ವಂದೇ ಮಹಾಪುರುಷ ತೇ ಚರುಣಾರಭಿಂದ ಯತ್ ಪಾದಲ್ಲವಲಖಚಂದಮನಿ ಛಟಾಯ ವಿಸ್ಫುರ್ಜೀತ ಕಮಿ ಗವಧೂಷ್ವದರ್ಶಿ ಪೂರ್ಣಾನುರಾಗರ ಸುಸಾಗರ ಸಾರಮೂರ್ತಿ ಸಾರಾಧಿ ಕಾಮೈ ಕದಾಂಕಿಕೃಷ್ಣ ಚೈತನ್ಯ ಪ್ರಭು ನಿತ್ಯಾನಂದ ಸಿಯಾದೈತಗದಾಧರ ಶಿವ ಸದೀ ಗೌರಭಕ್ತವಿಂದ ಶ್ರೀಕೃಷ್ಣ ಚೈತನ್ಯ ಪ್ರಭು ನಿತ್ಯಾನಂದ ಸಿಯಾದೈತಗದಾಧರ ಶಿವ ಸದೀ ಗೌರಭಕ್ತವಿಂದ ಹರೇ ಕೃಷ್ಣ ಹರೇ ಕೃಷ್ಣ 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 ಹರೇ 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 ರಾಮ ಹರೇ ರಾಮ 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 ಹರೇ ಹರೇ ಅಜಾನುಲಂಬಿತ ಭುಜೌ ಕನುಕಾ ಬುಧಾತು ಶಂಕೀರ್ತನೈಕಪಿತರು ಕಮಲಾಯತಾಕ್ಷ ವಿಶಾಂಬರು ದ್ವಿಜವರು ಜುಗಧರ್ಮಪಾಲೌ ವಂದೇ ಜಗತ್ಪ್ರಿಯಕರು ಕರುಣಾಭತಾರು ಹರೇ ಕೃಷ್ಣ ಹರೇ ಕೃಷ್ಣ 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 ಹರೇ 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 ರಾಮ ಹರೇ ರಾಮ 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 ಹರಿ ಹರಿ ನಮಿ ಗಂಗೆ ತವ ಪಾದ ಪಂಕಜ ಸುರಸುರೈರ್ವಂದಿತೋ ದಿವ್ಯೂಪ ಭುಕ್ತಿ ಮುಕ್ತಿ ದಿ ನಿತ್ಯ ಭಾವಾನುಪೇನ್ನ ಸದಾ ನರಾನ ಗಂಗಾತರಂಗರಮಣೀಯ ಜಟಾಕಲಾಪ ಗೌರೀ ನಿರಂತರ ವಿಭೂಷಿತ ಬಾಮ ಭಾಗ ನಾರಾಯಣೋ ಪ್ರಿಯ ಮನಂಗಮದಾಪಹಾರ ವರಾನಸಿ ಪುರಪತಿ ಭಜ ವೀಶ್ವನಾಥ ವಾಗೀಶಜುಷ್ವದನೆ ಲಕ್ಷ್ಮೀರ್ಜಶ್ಚ ವಕ್ಷಸಿ ಜಸ್ಯಾಸ್ತಿ ಹೃದಯ ಸಂಬಿದ್ ಸ್ವಂಗಮಹಂ ಭಜೆ ಹರೇ ಕೃಷ್ಣ ಹರೇ ಕೃಷ್ಣ 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 ಹರೇ 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 ರಾಮ ಹರೇ ರಾಮ 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 ಹರಿ ಹರಿ ನೈವಾತ್ಮನೋ 
प्रभुरय निजलाभपूर्ण नैवात्मनो प्रभुरय निजलाभपूर्ण जानमदुषो वनितो विनीते जज्जनो भगवते विदधीमान तत्मनपति मुखश जुखश्री नैवात्मनो प्रभुरय निजलाभपूर्ण मान जनाद विदुषो करुण विनीते जद जद जनो भगवते विदधी तमान तत्मने प्रतिमुखश जुखश्री गौरी गोष्ठीपति शिशिल भक्ति सिद्धांत सरस्वती गोस्वामी जगत प्रभुपाद जगदगुरु टोल विदाउट डेवलपिंग संबंध ज्ञान यू कैनॉट स्टार्ट योर भजन गौरीय गोष्ठीपति शिशिल भक्ति सिद्धांत सरस्वती गोस्वामी जगत प्रभुपाद जगत गुरु टोल विदाउट डेवलपिंग संबंध ज्ञान Even you cannot start your bhajan, not possible. In kirtan, we know Bengali kirtan, Bhakti Mukta Guru writing, "Samandha janiya bhujite bhujite abhimano habadur." Samandha janiya bhujite bhujite abhimano habadur. How to eliminate all abhiman, false ego? That is the main issue. Bhajan we can do after. It's not now question. Actual bhajan. First point: How to eliminate my false ego. That is the main issue. Which is next to impossible for a bonded soul. And Mahaprabhu going to. my po going to give our identity what is our actual identity mahapo was speaking all bonded souls in general they are krishna das jive swarup hai krishna nitya das das mean das always supposed to render seva do seva to his master usually we know Das mean das is supposed to serve Prabhu. That's why in general we have this kind of conception. Again about Jeep Tatha we know this, but Mahaprabhu speaking some more speciality. What is that Mahaprabhu speaking? Na ham bippo na cha norupati na api bhisho na sudro na hang borni na cha gya pati na manusodirva kintu padhan nikula parmanand purnamita dhir. गोपी भरतूर पद कमल और दास उदास दास उदास अनुदास आजीवात्मा कैन गेट द हाइस्ट फैसिलिटी टॉप मोस्ट फैसिलिटी विच इज रेयर टू एक्सचेंज लाव ए फेयर विथ नंदनंद एंड कृष्ण टू एक्सचेंज लाव ए फेयर विथ नारायण यू कैन डू इट but you cannot get the facility to exchange all rasa only two and a half rasa you can get only and only with nandanandan sri krishna you can exchange all five rasa at a time all five rasa at the same time all gauna rasa all primary rasa secondary rasa all you can exchange Only and only, only and only, I know. Only and only, it is possible with Krishna. Only and only, it is possible with Krishna. Ram Chandra, Nishingo Dev, Baraho Dev, Narayan, with nobody you can do. It's not possible. Only with Bhagwan Sri Krishna. and about all rasa i don't know whether you have any basic idea about rasa i know material conception of material rasa you have 
But aprakita rasa anuvuti feelings you have or not? That is the main question. If you have any basic concession, then you can understand that among all rasa, topmost rasa is actually madhur rasa. And madhur rasa also there is division, swakiya, parokiya, there is so many division. Mahaprabhu wanted to indicate that parakya rasa, gopi bhartur padakamalaya dasundas, dasu dasanu dasa. Gopi bhartur, gopi bhartur mean gopinath. Gopinath is going to take care of gopis, all gopis, protecting. So gopi bhartur, who is taking care of gopi, is not gopi bhartur. And Gopi Bhartu, Gopinath. Gopi Bhartu is Gopinath. Gopinath giving pro full protection to all Gopikas, enjoying all you know, rasa with them all the time. So Mahaprabhu is going to indicate that for a bonded soul, this is the topmost, you know, luck, topmost facility you can get. Now, Jiva Sarup, I already discussed. All Jiva, respective Jiva, they have some fixed Sarup. They have some fixed Sarup. According to that, according to that, they, get, they can get some, according to that, they can get some backing from Sadhu, different Sadhu. Suppose somebody have a Saksharas, inside Sarup. So naturally, if he is going to meet with some Sakhara Sadhu, Siddha Mahatma, he can get some inspiration. So Sadhu Sangha can give you only backing, so that you can express your original Sarup inside your heart. For the expression, for the expression of your secret Sarup, Sadhu Sangha can help you this much. Different jivas, they have some fixed sarup. According to that, they can get test according to their association. If somebody Maduras, devotee in sarupa, they can get inspiration, they can get some backing. Also about Madurasa. You can, you know, get Swakya rasa, not always Parakya rasa, everything. Like one example I can give. Sila Kavi Karnapur. Sila Kavi Karnapur writing the books. Writing the books. Gaura Ganadis Deepika. All Gauranga Parshat, all their eternal identity, who is they, who they are, all their respective identity, he wanted to write. Gauro Ganodesh, try to understand it is Sanskrit word. Or Bengali also you can say, those who are having clear idea about Bengali language, they can understand. Gauro Ganodesh or Hindi, if they have idea, they can understand. But outside people can understand. Gaura Ganaha, Gaura Gana mean all the parshat of Gaura. Uddesh, Uddesh Mane, to find out their eternal identity, Gaura Gana Desh Deepika. Deepika Mane, it is one compilation, compilation of the subject matter. Which subject matter? Eternal Sharup of all Gaura Parshat. Follow. Like about Narthamathakura, I already told. You have some wrong conception about who is Parshat, who is not. It's then Bhakti Muttaku just, you know, took birth, you know, within 200 years. How you can say Gaura Parshat? Parshat conception not coming that way. Your conception of Parshad, 
who is Parshat, who is not, that way you cannot calculate. Like Narottam Thakur taking birth late, even Narottam Thakur physically not going to see Chaitanya Mahaprabhu. When Narottam Thakur running to take darshan, by this time disappear. So what? So what? Narottam Thakur is the eternal Parshat of Bhagavan. Narottam Thakur surely eternal Parshat of Bhagavan. Champak. Lata Manjuri, Champak Manjuri. I mean in Gaur Lila, his eternal Sarup is Narthama Thakur. And in Krishna Lila, his eternal Sarup is Champak Manjuri. Now you can put question, why, how possible Maharaj? Same, you know, how possible to, if going to participate, if going to particip participate, you know, I mean, do seva and Gaur Lila. How? Because we know Gaur Lila and Krishna Lila all eternally present, you know. I told you. Now you can put question. How possible? Whereas you already told Gaur Lila eternal, Krishna Lila eternal, then how, you know, one man can go here and there? How possible, Maharaj? This is your material conception. That's why I told now, you give your intellect, I like to throw it into garbage. That's why I told. You cannot apply. Never mind. Point is that, Jiva Goswami was writing, Jiva Goswami was writing, <laughs> Jiva Goswami was writing, that this is the, ex, this is the extraordinary, excellent facility. This is the excellent facility of Gaur Bhajan. If you do Gaur Bhajan, then you can, you know, take part here, take part there, both, possible. Gaur Bhajan, only in Gauriya Bhajan, this kind of facility is reserved. Other Bhajan, you cannot get this kind of facility, all, all the time. Same, you know, Narthama Thakur, in one form can serve Gaur Lila, Another in another form you can serve Krishna Lila. It's possible in Gauriya Bhajan, possible. Two part, but one. Same like Gauranga and Radha Govinda same. Same question I can put in front of you. If Radha Govinda same, how possible go? And if go possible, how Radha Govinda possible? Two separate. Same thing. Gaur and Gaur Bhakta. Goranga Mahaprabhu, same with Radha Govindu. If I can say this way, Goranga Mahaprabhu taking the form of Radha Govindu. So why not possible about our co-devotees, same thing? Same thing applicable. This way, not to have eternal person of Gauranga and at the same time eternal, you know, you know, Manjari there in Radha Govindu Leela. Our in Gaur Ganadesh Tipika, in Gaur Ganadesh Tipika, Kavi Karnapur, writing, there it is written that Jagadananda Pandit is a Satya Bhyama. Jagadananda Pandit is Satya Bhyama, you know? Satya Bhyama, you heard the name of Satya Bhyama, no? Eh? Satya Bhyama. Rukini Sotobhama or Darika in Darika. In Darika, you know, Patrani, Queen of Krishna. Queen in the sense I should not speak Queen because Krishna anyway not going to sit in throne. So I can say the you know Shakti, Krishna Shakti or wife. Sixteen thousand one hundred eight. Wives of Krishna. 16,108 wives of Krishna. Simultaneously at a time, Krishna is going to marry them. 16,008 already before married. There is a condition. So, our in Gaur Ganadha Dipika, Kobi Karnapur writing that Jagadananda Pandit 
is a Shakta Bhama of Darika. Darika Dham. Daruka Dhamna. Then Shakta Bhama. So accordingly, that kind of mood. What kind of mood? So much attraction for Krishna love affair. The in between, I already told you, the way of love is like snack, jigjag. I told that day. Ahe riva gatihi premana sabhava kutido bhavet. Very intricate subject matter. Love affair, prema is so intricate subject matter, you cannot understand. Prema is such an intricate subject matter, what is happening? Between Sattva Bhama, Krishna, between Radharani, all, you know, here, Brajaparika, what happened? You cannot make any head and tail. You will have to go up to that far. You can remember I told you now, without Guru Sheva, without Sammandagyan, you can never start bhajan. If you try to serve Gurudev, Vaishnava, without any Sammandagyan, and the platform is totally different. Gurudev is a, a prakita platform, transcendental platform, you are material platform. How you can serve? Suppose Gurudev is there in fourth floor. Suppose Gurudev is there in fourth floor and you are serving, you are sevak, you are ground floor. If somebody is speaking, now is the milk, uh, you know, you make the, hot, make the milk hot and go to Guru Maharaj's room and give him, offer to Bhagavan and give him. Now is the milk climb. Milk climb now. If, that, if the uh, Sevak staying ground floor, he will have to take action. He will have to go up for floor, enter the room, meet Guru Maharaj. This is the procedure. Similarly, follow what I say. Your platform is now this platform. And Guru Vaishnava here, transcendental, there is, you cannot make up the gapping. You cannot make up the backing, gapping. To make up the gapping is called bhajan. Many times I told, to, to clear your darshan. Yesterday I told, na, a tiger when look at you, I am going to get a midday milk, a midday meal. Very nice meal today, midday meal. But when I look at you, I can see my sweet mother sitting. There is a difference. All cats and dogs and snack, who... Who not every creature, frog, bear, you know, bird, they have their respective darshan. All they have. Because they have eyes. If they, are, if, if they have eyes, surely they have darshan. But it depends what kind of darshan they have. Bhajan means not playing. Bhajan is so practical. Bhajan is, bhajan is so practical, I can scientifically prove in front of everybody. How, you know, what is the reaction of prasadam? You can take prasadam from outside, anywhere. I don't like to name. You can pay money and take prasadam. And, one, and for five, seven days, I can give you prasadam, a pure devotee cooking offering. A pure sadhu going to give you prasadam. Now within seven days you can discover a heaven and heaven and hell difference of your consciousness. I can practically show you. You can take prasadam from a pros in the guise of you know tilak mala. Oh, so nice lady, pros. Everywhere this kind of problem happened. Why they are not going to make any progress? Why? I practically I can prove you. And for seven days I can give you treatment. Continuous for Sadhana Giri. You can see Maharaj, I feel some change. No chanchal bhav. Temperament is very cool. So this way, to change your darshan, to clear Cheto Darpana Marjana Mahaprabhu told na same thing na. Same thing Mahaprabhu told na. Cheto Darpana Marjanam. Cheto Darpana Marjanam. Baba Madhu. By the help of Sankirtan. By the help of Sankirtan. Chetadar Pranamarjana.
Bhava Maha Dabagni. Now forest fire they are glowing inside your heart. How I can extinguish if you cannot hear Harikatha properly? If you have no relationship with me, how I can deliver you? That is the main question. How I can deliver you? How I can how my Guru Maharaj can deliver me if I have no relationship with my Guru Maharaj? Only simply I have taken Diksha Maharaj. What Diksha you want? What Diksha you have taken? You show me? You show me what, what Diksha you have taken? They are going to increase the number of dogs and cats. Excuse me. Going to increase the number of dogs and cats and jackal. You show me? You show me you are a realized soul and you are giving Diksha to one realized soul? And you are going to make one realize so? If you have no realization, if you have no realization inside your heart, if you have no realization inside your heart, what you can give me by Harikatha, idiot? What you can give by Diksha? If you are, if you yourself you have no realization, what you can give to me? Huh? What you can give to me? You have no right to speak that kind of die philosophy. You have no right to speak that kind of philosophy if, you have, if your background is very weak. You have no right if you have no realization. If you have no direct realization, you have no right to speak that philosophy in front of public to get pranami and clapping. Idiot. You have no right. So Diksha means to develop Dibba Gyan, Dibba Gyan transcendental knowledge. You can discover in dream, in practically you can discover your relationship with Gurudev. Every fraction of second I should remember my Guru Maharaj. The moment I forget, within this gapping, Maya can enter and give it, provide a kick and throw me into the ocean of Maya. Every fraction of second I have to remember my Gurudev. Who can give protection? Anyway, Krishna not coming. Gurudev can give protection. Gurudev can give protection. Who, who is Krishna? Gurudev can give relations with this, this is Krishna. I love him. I serve him all twenty. You will also do it. This way. That is why. Shamanda janiya bhajite bhajite abhimana habidur. Very simple. By after discovering your perfect relationship with Guru Vaishnava, then go on doing bhajan, harinam. Then you can understand everything. All your false ego, everything can go away. All anartha can go away. You can clean your heart. You can make a sizable progress in the way of your Hari Bhajan. But nobody is going to speak the truth. They are going to, they are going to speak very tasteful philosophy. All they like to speak some tasteful philosophy in front of you, so that is very catchy for you. Tasteful, no? Very tasteful, you catch it. Oh, yes, he is nice sadhu. He is nice sadhu. So nice speaking. Bhakti Muttaka speaking, not so easy. Not so easy to understand. Bhakti Muttaka giving in Chaitanya Sikha, everywhere you can go. Chaitanya, you know, there. Bhajan, you know, Bhajan, yeah. In Jaiva Dharma, Chaitanya Sikha you can find. Also in, you know, Bhakti Muttaka, Bani Vaibhav, then book, there. Bhakti Muttaka speaking, in the name of Sadhu, in the, name, in the name of sadhu, if you are going to serve one non-devotee, not sadhu, is a kopat. Sweet behavior, very sweet, catchy. Always smiling face, very nice, but inside, inside heart, there is a very sharp edge knife to cut your throat. Very sweet. So sweet behavior, because that is the instrument. That is the only instrument, no? sweet behavior. That is the only support. They have nothing. No? So what to do? 
Only they have only one thing. That is a device, instrument by the help of which you can kill, they can kill you. Very sharp, very sharp aged, very sharp aged knife inside heart and outside, ha ha ha, very nice. Very smiling face. So nice hospitality extra. But you have no idea. When Guru Vaishnava slap you, it is called actual hospitality. It is called actual love. It can beat you. Get out from me. I expect when my Guru Maharaj can speak, you idiot, get out. I am waiting for the moment. Kesav Goswami are waiting. When Popat can say, you foolish number one, up! Kesav Goswami are crying and speaking. Who can speak me that I am foolish number one? Popat gone. We can never expect honor and respect from Guru Pat Padmo. We cannot expect self honor, respect, and respect from Guru Pat Padmo. The day I can expect honor and respect from Guru Pat Padmo, that is my domesday. Domesday, no, last day. I can die. Guru Pat Padmo can cheat you according to a cheating propensity. If I find you are going to cheat me, can cheat you. You cannot understand. So sweetly can cheat you, you cannot understand. This way, I have no right to speak that kind of philosophy if I have no direct realization about that. I have no right. So, first of all, you will have to grow your Sammandha again or Guru Vishnu. After that, you can start Bhajan. Ado Shadhya Tatoha Sadhu Sangha Atha Anatha Nibriti Shat Hello Ado Shadhya Tatoha Sadhu Sangha This way gradually I can show you, you can go. You cannot jump. And within this Sadhu Sangha there is you know, so many calculation. So many calculation. Preliminary Sadhu Sangha after that, taking diksha from a Sadguru. If you are going to pay attention to sweet behavior, your accommodation, then you are. If you are ready to get a kick from Guru Vaishnav, then you can come out successful. But foolish world, I have nothing to speak. They respect all honor, respect, money, position, accommodation. Nice, nice thing they expect. So they are going to die. So this way you see, about Jagadananda Pandit I told, Jagadananda Pandit is the eternal parsat of Gauranga Mahaprabhu, as a Jagadananda Pandit. At the same time, Jagadananda Pandit, you know, Kabi Karnapur speaking, in Gaur Ganadesh Dipika, Kobi Karnabu speaking. Actually, Jagadana Pandit, he identifies his Satyabhyama. Why? How? Because Satyabhyama becomes very angry. Sweet angriness. Satyabhyama always becomes angry. Little, little, small, small thing. I don't like to see this. Why? Bhagavan Sri Krishna going to heaven you know, going to collect Parijat, you know, Parijat, Parijat, one, one tree, special tree, special, special flower, Parijat, Parijat flower, it is available in heaven. Parijat flower, if you put, is not, you know, for two days, three days, not, you cannot destroy, very nice flower. So beautiful, I have not seen Parijat flower. How I can explain? I heard only. Parijat flower. So Krishna is going to collect Parijat flower from heaven, you know, and with, you know, Rukini, and going to, going to plant that, you know, plant that tree there. Near the house of, you know, follow this way. So, Satyabhama become angry. Satyabhama become very angry because 
Krishna going to give some parija flower into the, you know, in, in the hair of... I am not getting, became angry. Not eating, not drinking, going to, you know. On those days, there is one special room. There is one special room. If queen is queen, if queen of anybody became angry, she or he can enter that room and lock the room and stay. Then king can take him over, oh, become angry. It's <laughs> the name of the room is, <laughs> name of the room is Goshaghar. Goshamane, angry room. If somebody becomes angry, it's a room, angry room. Somebody becomes angry, can enter. Not eating anything. Then king, then king can take preparation how to solve the problem. So, Sottabhama not coming out, Sottabhama not doing. Then Krishna going to solve the problem. I can also give you, no problem. This way. So, actually, Sottabhama always became angry because strong love affair. Strong, though it is not parakya bhav. Within Maduras, within Maduras, there is some excellency. I can prove it in Gaudlila, because it is written by Krishna Das Kaviraj Goswami. Our Gadadhar Pandit, his mood, Gadadhar Pandit, his mood is favorable, always, positive. And Sattap and uh, Jagadananda Pandit, his mood is always negative. I can prove it, Krishna Das Kaviraj Goswami writing. Very nicely. So now point is that Jagadananda Pandit is Shatabhyama, but but in Chaitanya Charitamito, I in in Prema Bibartha, we can find. In Prema Bibartha we can find one clue that Mahaprabhu always want to speak, you are Satabhyama of Daruka. But Jagadananda became very angry. Why? I'm Satyabhyama. I like to get the lotus feet of Radharani. You like to throw me in Daruka? He's speaking, written there. My Guru Maharaj in editorial page writing so nicely. Where Gauranga Mahapu in between, sometimes speaking. You are Satyabhyama. Ah, I'm Satyabhyama. Ah, I'm Satyabhyama. You like to throw me in Daruka? Eh? I like to get the lotus feet of Radharani. You like to push me forcefully there in Dharaka. I don't like to go to Dharaka. Merely written. Jagadananda himself speaking in Prema Vibhartha. So, Guru Padma writing and Guru Bhargava writing, maybe he is Satyabhyama, but I don't know, in Gaur Lila, he is very much interested to get the lotus feet of Radharani. So speaking that way, because I cannot say Kobi Karnapur, you know, making cal wrong calculation. I cannot say Kobi Karnapur making wrong calculation. If Kobi Karnapur is going to get the, you know, the main finger of the right, right hand, uh, uh, right leg, Chaitanya Mahapu, right leg, right leg is the main finger. Chaitanya Mahaprabhu giving in the mouth of Kobi Karnapur in small age. The boy playing, Mahaprabhu taking his uh, uh, right leg and giving the right, you know, right leg finger into the mouth of Kobi Karnapur. So how we can say Kobi Karnapur making mistake? Kobi Karnapur cannot, okay, it can so happen. Follow. Like I can give you example, this Kaji, he was Kamsa. Kaji was Kamsa, na? Previously it is written. No, now Kaji is concentrating onto a lotus feet of Gaur. What is this? Kaji is Kamsa actually, previously he was Kamsa. But in this life, how you develop this kind of strong, you know, attraction for Gaur? The conversation, the conversation between Kaji and Gaurang Mahaprabhu at the time of evolution of Sankirtan, you know. All Mahaprabhu with all devotees going, started agitation. Going, you know, going into the house of, you know, 
Khaji, you can go through that conversation in Chaitanya Bhagavad. You can go. Today you can go and search. You can see. So, it's quite natural. It can so, it can so happen. So, Jagadananda Pandit, Chaitanya Mahaprabhu speaking. Because our Gadadar Pandit always, always going to show positive mood. I can give one example. Because it is written by Kishodas Kabiraj Sosan. Our Gadadar Pandit, you can remember Ballabhatta. You can know the name of Ballabhatta, you heard. Ballabhatta, I mean Ballabhacharya, later. Ballabhatta Mapu went to the house of Ballabhatta, that side of the river of Ganga Jumanasa confluence in Allahabad, Aral, Aral village. And a village named Aral. There Mahaprabhu went, that house, their house, they came to take Mahaprabhu, invite Mahaprabhu, the prasadam, everything, you know, Pushpanjali washed the lake, Mahaprabhu went there. There Mahaprabhu meet with one pure devotee, whose name is, eh? who is the disciple of, uh, his name is uh, Raghupati Upadhyay. He is a disciple of Madhavendra Puripad. Mahapu talking where different Siddhanta topics with him. Mahapu was very happy. I can discuss this point. Go to him expect because today but the time is very limited. I cannot touch, I like to touch so many areas. But not possible. There actually Balabhata, you know was successful to get the kipa of Gauranga Mahaprabhu, Chaitanya Chandra. But uh, how, we don't know, how he developed this, maybe something happened, I don't know. I have no right to pass any comment. Because who is going to get the kipa of Gauranga? Gauranga Mahaprabhu, how it is possible for him to develop false ego again? So maybe something happened, I have no right. To pass any remark, he is a elevated devotee. He wanted to ignore, ignore in the sense, eh, useless, and not so important. He wanted to show no importancy. He never wanted to show importancy to Rupa Goswami Pad. After that, he was bound to show. I told na, Jibu Goswami Pada Abhir Bhaktira, I told na. What book you are reading? What book, what book you are writing now? Actually, very, very humble na. Rupa Goswami Pada. Actually, Rasa Amrita Sindhu. Rasa Amrita Sindhu writing. Well, I can edit that book. You see, what is it? The question of editing coming, when you can find some fault? Whereas we know, Sriman Mahaprabhu, Ishwar Puripad writing Krishna Lilamrita. Ishwar Puripad writing one book, Krishna Lilamrita. And someday Ishwar Puripad requesting. That time Mahaprabhu was not initiated. I mean, it is one kind of Lila. <laughs> Mahaprabhu initiated means he was joking. But still I am about to say, that time he was not initiated by Ishwar Puripad. Ishwar Puripad is coming and for some days, staying here in Mayapur Dam, taking prasadam from Sochima and Malinima, all staying very, and sometimes meeting Gauranga Mahaprabhu. Gauranga Mahaprabhu liked to meet. Someday, Ishwar Prabhu was speaking. Actually, I heard you are great Pandit. Ishwar Prabhu was speaking to Mahaprabhu. Actually, I heard you are great Pandit. So, could you please? And uh, could you please uh, edit my book? I wrote already, um, I have written, you know, Krishna Lilamrita, Mahaprabhu laughing. Actually, you are pure devotee. Whatever you are writing, Mahaprabhu, Krishna going to accept it. So I have no right to edit that book. Mahaprabhu speaking, for our teachings. When Ishwar Prabhupada speaking, I heard you were a great Pandit. So, could you please take trouble to go through that book to find some fault? Maybe some fault. Must be some fault. Mahaprabhu laughing. 
Actually, you are pure devotee. And Bhagavan always going to accept your Baba. So I have no right to find any fault in you. No, no, don't speak that way. Actually, actually, if there is any fault, why not you speak? It is not your fault. It is my request. It is my request. I know it is not your aparat, not nothing. It is my request to you. Mahaprabhu one day joking. Mahaprabhu reading the book. There is one datu root. It's not applicable here. Huh? That root not applicable? No, not here. Mahaprabhu joking and gone. And whole day and night, Ishad Buddha was thinking, Are, there is Atma de, Atmane Padi, it is Sanskrit, there is different kind of you know, datu, root. Without understanding any root, if you apply, your writing is totally wrong. You know, root. Eh? This way, Ishar Puripa is writing, uh, Ishar Puripa is thinking whole day and night. Next day, next, next day meeting with Mahaprabhu. Yesterday you told that Datu, that root is not applicable here. But whole day and night I calculate, I find it's not wrong. Mahaprabhu is smiling and gone. Purposely Mahaprabhu is joking with him. Mahaprabhu is joking with him. It is the nature of Bhagavan. It is the nature of Bhagavan. Bhagavan likes to get defeated in front of devotee. It is the nature. It is the nature of Bhagavan. Bhagavan always likes to get defeated. <laughs> Follow. Like Pitama Bhisha fighting. Anywhere you find. Always Bhagavan is the nature of Bhagavan. Sweet nature of Bhagavan. Bhagavan with, you know, Advaita Gosai. I can speak, uh, Gaurapurnim day, how Mahaprabhu is defeated in front of Advaita Gosai. Purposely, Mahaprabhu likes to get defeated. It is one kind of loveful behavior. Anyway, so, Balabhata, how dare? How dare Balabhata going to speak? Okay, I can edit that book. Jiva Goswami was there. You can edit that book. If at all there is, a, there is any mistake, then Jiva Goswami was speaking. I have no time to discuss this issue, very important. Then Jiva Goswami Path asking him, what mistake you have, what mistake you have discovered? So then you are speaking, who are you? What, this, what mistake you have seen in the book? So that you are speaking, you can edit? So much adversity. This way, I don't know, after getting the kipa, maybe it is one kind of lila. This is the solution. If I pass remark that Ballabhato has grown a tamagun or a false ego, it's bad, Siddhanta. Maybe it is one kind of lila. Because in a drama, you will have to take the part of a demon. I will have to take the part of a devotee. You will have to take the part of, you know, this is drama. It is one kind of drama. I cannot pass this kind of book. Ballabhatta is great. So now Ballabhatta in go in Pur in Nilachal Dham. Ballabhatta always wants to establish himself. Ballabhatta always wants to establish himself in front of Mahaprabhu. And Mahaprabhu likes to follow Trinanda Vibhav. So Mahaprabhu cannot like you. If you are not going to follow Trinanda Vibhav, surely Mahaprabhu can throw you out. Only key, only the key, only the key is there, that is Trinanda You cannot open the, open the kingdom of love. Trinanda Only the key. So Ballabhatta always want to establish in front of Mahaprabhu. I have written one commentary on Bhagavatam. I don't like to accept, accept, I cannot accept the commentary by, you know, you know, Siddha Saipad. What? What do you say? Mahaprabhu speaking. No, I cannot. Shami nahi mane tare besha madde goni. 
He is a pros who is going to ignore his husband. Mahapu ignored him. Go. After some days, I have written, I have written all different, you know, Siddhanta Vichar of Harinam, Krishnanam. Krishnanam? On Krishnanam, I have written so many commentary. Mahapu is thinking, I am actually illiterate. I am illiterate, I have not, I have no right to hear it. Only I know is Jasodha Nandan, Nandan Nandan Krishna. Only I know, Nandan Nandan Krishna, Jasodha Nandan Krishna, this I know. I need not, I need not uh, know anything. What I can do? I am illiterate. He forcefully, he forcefully going to read this book in front of Gadadhar. And Gadadhar cannot insult. He is a very soft personality. Gadadhar Pandit is a very soft, per soft personality. He cannot insult. You hear me, you hear me. Gadadhar keeps silence. My Prabhu is going to ignore how I can hear, but cannot speak. Because he is a you know, elevated personality, if he cannot insult, so anyway, keep silence and go on hearing. Hare Krishna, Hare Krishna, Krishna. He is doing Harinam inside and he is forcefully reading. What to do? And Mahapu is going to get the information. Mahapu is going to get the information that Godadar is going to hear the explanation of you know, Krishnanam. Mahapu is going to show angry attitude. Mahapu is going to show false, false angry, false, false angry attitude in front of Godadhar. Oh, you are giving honor to him. Okay, very good. You are the perceptor. Godadhar started crying heavily. What I can do? He is reading forcefully. He is reading forcefully. He is crying heavily. He cannot talk with Mahaprabhu, can look at Mahaprabhu. And Mahaprabhu then started laughing. I wanted to make a game with you. I wanted to make a play, a game with you. But he was so simply hearted, like Rukini, he started crying. Popa writing commentary. Popa writing commentary. That like Rukini, one day Krishna joking, in Bhagavad Katha also, three, three years back I done. You can find there. Rukini and Bhagavan Sri Krishna going to make a, uh, make a, a joking with Rukini. Rukini, actually, I am not king. You are actually a daughter of a great, great king. So you should marry one uh, appropriate personality. So you should leave me. Because I am not king, I am actually a beggar, actually. Niskinchan. So, you have so many qualities. Actually, you are the daughter of a big king. So why not you go and marry and I, I give permission. No, there is no litigation. No divorce case. I can give you permission. Rukini started crying. Not crying. Rukini immediately fall down on ground. Fall down on ground, unconscious. Krishna immediately catch. And giving water in the mouth. Drinking water, <laughs> the Rukini. Ah, ah, sometime, you know, consciousness coming back, Bhagavan Sri Krishna laughing with him, laughing with her. I wanted to play one game with you, to see your love, how much love you have for me. But you, I, I was successful to make fool of you. I was very successful to make fool of you because you are very plain hearted. I am not going to leave you. This way, same mood. I mean, Rukini mood, you can find Rukini mood. What is the mood there in Rukini? Same mood you can find with Gadadhar. Gadadhar Pandit. Mahaprabhu and joking, Mahaprabhu chiding. Ah, you are the perceptor, you are going to hear. You are giving, giving, giving your association to him. You are taking his association, Sangha. While Ballabhatta reading that book and Godadar Pandit taking shelter of Mahaprabhu, Prabhu, 
you are sitting inside my heart, you can understand my mood. What I can do is reading forcefully. He is speaking already. But still, Mahaprabhu forcefully wanted to <laughs> joke with him. Mahaprabhu wanted to joke with him. Then Godadar cannot speak anything, only heavy crying, heavy crying. Then Mahaprabhu is speaking, you are going to buy me. You are actually going to buy me because your simplicity, your simple heart, by looking your simple heart, I am very surprised. You are going to buy me. Same thing, almost, almost same thing. But the, here is positive mood. Gadadhar and Rukkini, they have positive. I am not speaking the Gadadhar Pandit, the Rukkini. I already told, secret Tatta, Gadadhar is Radharani. Many times, three, four years for, you know, I already told different Tatta. But what I mean to say, the same Baba. Baba, same, positive Baba. But, Jagadananda Pandit is always negative Baba. Any time, always fighting going on. Always fighting going on. What to do? Fighting going on between Mahaprabhu and... Follow what I say. Whenever there is any problem, then Mahaprabhu calling Jagadananda, Jagadananda, come here. Can you do some seva? What seva? You will have to go to Sachima. I mean, my mother. <laughs> Mahaprabhu purpose is send him. Sometimes some problem happen. Jagadananda become angry. Mahaprabhu find solution. Jagadananda come here. Some seva there. What seva? You have to go to Bangla, Bengal. You have to meet with, you know, uh, mother, Sachi. Okay, really I can go. With some prasadam, with some, some Jagannath prasadam, everything. You have to go. Can you go? Yes. Yes, I can go. When? Today or tomorrow? Ready. Because angry at I can explain this point. What is the difference? What is the difference? What is the difference between material angry attitude and transcendental angry attitude? What is the basic difference between material angry attitude and loveful angry attitude? What is the basic difference? There I can explain. Follow what I say. Jagadana Bhuni ready. With Jagannath cloth, Jagannath wearing cloth, na? with packing, Mahaprabhu giving all prasadam, you go to Bangla, distribute all prasadam among, among all devotees. He is going with full enthusiastic attitude. Because seva, if a devotee getting seva, you can be very, very happy. And non devotee, what is the symptom? If you go say, well, I was supposed to do, but there is some problem I cannot do. There is the basic difference, bonded soul. If they are getting seva from sadhu, you cannot do. Ah, actually, I am told to do say seva, but there are some, I have pre-engagement some. This way they like to avoid seva. That is the difference between pure devotee, this is the difference between pure devotee and non-devotee. I mean half devotee, who is not. So Jagadananda Pandit taking trouble to go to Bangla to distribute all prasadam, taking the message from Sachimata, so many things from so many devotees there in Shantipur, you know, here, there they meet and distribute prasadam, send by all prasadam, Jagadananda. That time, because that now you can hire one car and come from Calcutta airport. So facility. <laughs> But that time you have to walk, you have to walk 700 kilometers, 800 kilometers, 1500 kilometers you have to walk. Can you walk? Oh my God, no need of Krishna Vajan. What I can do? So much travel. Huh? Krishna Vajan mean travel. Krishna Vajan mean travel. I can allow to sit inside AC room and give prasadam. I can clean your prasadam plate. I can give, uh, wash your clothes, everything. Can you do bhajan? Hari bhajan, you show me? Inside one room, I can put you. Hari bhajan is not so easy. They can cheat you. Hari bhajan is not so easy, but so easy. 
Hari Bhajan is not so easy, but so easy, so easy, that without Hari Bhajan I don't like to do anything. So easy. I don't like to do anything. You can try me. I don't know. What? Useless. I have no time. I don't understand Hari Bhajan, but by, by the mercy of Gurudeva, a little, little bit some understanding coming, realization. That's why if you kill me, cut my throat, but still I am going to live. Life and soul. Krishna Bhajan is life and soul. So Jagadananda Pandit, you know, they are going to Bangla. And while coming back, Jagadananda Pandit is going to carry some big pot. So many things. Because Jibod is giving this thing, you can give to Prabhu, you can give to Prabhu. So, all bundle is there. And one, one pot is there, one pot is there, there is going to make Ayurvedic medicine oil. Ayurvedic medicine oil. If Mahaprabhu is going to apply this oil, then his brain becomes very cool. Follow. Because the conception of Jagadananda is very sweet conception. Jagadananda is thinking, Mahaprabhu always crying and uh, sometimes this. So maybe some, some bayu, you know, there is three, you know, bayu, one is air, cough and bile. Biles, you know, Ayur Ayurvedic doctor, any doctor, material doctor, they have no idea, especially Ayurvedic doctor, first of all can check you, che can check you. Watch you. What is your activity? What is your behavior? They cannot watch or pulse. Touch so much. They understand. So, if biles, a bile spitta, cough and air, instead of, if not balancing, going to disturb, then you become sick. So, Jagadananda going to think that, my Prabhu, actually there is some disturbance of bayu. Air. Yeah. So he is crazy, he is uh, showing the Leela of crazy, cannot eat, always crying. Jagadananda was thinking, my Prabhu become very sick. So better I can uh, make one very Ayurvedic doctor, an important doctor. Whatever amount I need, I can, pay. You can make one while very nice Narayan tail. Uh, after that, Jagadananda Pandit is going to carry that while very carefully, carrying on head. It is for Prabhu. It is for Prabhu. Prabhu can apply on head and Prabhu become you know, very peaceful. Otherwise, sometimes what happens? Who knows? Because Jagadananda don't understand. Jagadananda cannot understand what happens. What happens? Jagadananda is thinking. So, this way, Jagadananda is going to carry the Ayurvedic oil, very nice Ayurvedic oil. For Mahaprabhu, for his application on head. Application in head. So what's wrong in it? Jagadando, long way, 700 kilometers. Can you think? 700 kilometers. 700 kilometers, Jagadando way. Coming to Purushottam Dham. They are going to give this wild pot because Govinda is a servant. Govinda servant, huh? Govinda, you know, know the name of Govinda. Govinda serving Mahapu all day and night. So giving the wild pot to Govinda. Govinda try to preserve, try to preserve this high, high class Ayurvedic oil. My Prabhu become very sick. Sometime you can take the oil and apply. Prabhu can take bath and sleep nicely. Then all problem finish. Giving the wild pot to Govinda. And Govinda actually, one day speaking to Prabhu, Prabhu, you know, we have one wild pot and a very nice uh, uh, Ayurvedic oil preparation. You will have to apply on it. Who, who give you? Mapo become very annoyed. Who give you? Jagadana. After hearing the name of Jagadananda, we become very careful. Because if something happens, Jagadananda can uh, start fasting. <laughs> and jump into ocean. Jagadananda? Yes, Jagadananda. But you can speak to Jagadananda, I am sannyasi. I am sannyasi. How I can apply oil? How I can apply oil? I am sannyasi. 
I don't know, Jagadana requests you to apply this oil. Oh, oh, if I apply a very scented oil, very nice smell, then everybody can say this sannyasi is kapat sannyasi. Everybody can say, now when I can go, move, and all nice smell can go, oh, where is from? The sannyasi apply well? The me, he is actually woman association doing. You can think that way. A kapat sannyasi can speak. So anyway, I cannot apply it. You can, you can ask Jagadananda, you can request Jagadananda to give this oil to Jagannath temple because that time there was no current. Electricity was not there. So in Jagannath temple, there is one lamp, you know, oil lamp. So Jagadananda, you can ask Jagadananda, you can ask Jagadananda, I already told, they to give this oil pot to the panda. They can put in oil pot and the Jagannath, uh, you know, light can be there. He can request him. After that, Govinda going to request to Jagadananda, I already tried my best. Pandit, Pandit, I tried my best to pursue Mahaprabhu, to take this while. But Mahaprabhu, not only Mahaprabhu become angry, how I can apply, I am sannyasi, I cannot apply this while on my head. So better you can give this wild pot to that Jagannath temple and uh, that oil best utilization. The best utilization. The best utilization of that oil. Because he is coming long way, he is giving energy. Energy becomes successful, Jagannath is going to accept. Jagannath become very angry. So angry, I cannot speak. But you know, when angry, Sometime Mahapu meet with Jagadhan, Jagadhan, no, excuse me, actually the oil you bring from Bengal, I cannot have. Who told you? Who told you I bring oil? Who told you? Wrong information? I'm not bringing any oil for you. Take the oil pot, come outside in front of throw a glass bottle, and you know, all broken, all around, oil, and gone inside room, lock the road, all around oil. Who told you I bring oil? Who told you? I not bring any oil for you. Taking the oil pot and throw in front of Mahaprabhu, all broken, all baranda, oil and oil. Gone inside room. Gone inside room. Lock the room and stay. Mahaprabhu said, big problem. I cannot find any solution. I cannot find what to do. I cannot apply oil at the same time. It is not my intention to, you know, disappoint, you know, Jagadananda, what to do? No solution. Because there no, either Mahaprabhu can use that oil, but it cannot. There is no solution. So Mahaprabhu cannot find a solution, what to do? There is no solution. I will have to apply. He is forcing me. I don't apply, then I am going to lose. Jagadananda going to become angry. What to do? No balancing position. Finally, what happens? For two, three days, for three days consecutively, consecutively for three days, Jagadananda locked the room, no water, no prasadam, nothing. Mahapu become very disappointed. What to do? Then Mahapu himself going to pursue Jagadananda. The room is locked. Talk, talk, talk. Jagadananda, talk, talk, talk. Jagadananda, Jagadananda not giving any response, became angry. Jagadananda not responding. Finally, when many times, Jagadananda not responding. Jagadananda, I am going to see, to take bath. I can come back and take prasadam in your hand. I am going. Then Mahaprabhu gone. Immediately, Jagadananda opened the door. Hey, Nandai, Ramai, come. Prabhu like to take prasadam immediately. Make sabji, this, that. Within, made, started cooking. Because Mahaprabhu, while calling, not responding, Mahaprabhu, this is the solution. Or only solution. Jagadananda, I am going to take bath in sea. You know, after coming back, I am hungry. I can take prasadam from you. You can. Immediately, Mahapu gone, open the door. Oh, Ramai, oh, Nanda, I come quickly. Prabhu going to take prasadam. Cooking very nicely. And Mahaprabhu, 
going to not looking at Jagadananda. <laughs> now, solution. <laughs> Mahaprabhu taking prasadam. Mahaprabhu, all prasadam here. Mahaprabhu, one by one take. Oh, so nice. Sweet cooking. Actually, you are angry, na? That's why your cooking is so sweet. Mahaprabhu speaking. <laughs> the cooking, I never took this kind of, you know, nice preparation. Because you are hungry, because you are very angry. So when you are angry, then your cooking is very sweet. Mahaprabhu speaking. This way, Mahaprabhu wanted to find solution. Main Siddhanta Vichar is that, that in material world, if there is any angry attitude, he likes to make some problem with you. If you grow some enmity with somebody angry, oh, I can kill you, you come outside. Competition, fighting. Material world. Material world, in material world, if somebody is angry, he is surely going to throw, you know, everything and go away. He cannot serve you. In the material world, this is Siddhanta Vichar. In material world, if you find somebody is angry with you, he cannot serve you. Can serve you? He can throw everything and go away. And he can, he can try to take revenge, revenge against you. But in Aprakita Jagat, in Aprakita Jagat, Aprakita Love Affair, Aprakita Love Affair is so sweet, so sweet, that you cannot even imagine. It is beyond human comprehension. You can play your brain, oh, this way. You cannot understand. So sweet. So sweet. This way, Jagadananda is angry. It's okay. But not that way. Jagadananda is angry because Mahaprabhu is not going to accept Seva. Jagadananda is angry only for one reason. Mahaprabhu is not going to accept my Seva. Follow. Vishnu Devi, Devi become angry. Why? Mahaprabhu, my Prabhu is not going to take Seva from me. He is, he is and they are dancing whole night in Siva Sangan. In Sivas, in the house of, in the temple of Sivas, Mahaprabhu whole night dancing, you know, Rasa Leela, Sankirtan Rasa. So Vishnu Devi become angry because she is not going to get any scope to message the lake of Gauranga. Prabhu, my Prabhu. So their angry attitude and the angry attitude shown by some material person, there is a not, not heaven and hell difference. Even I cannot say there is heaven and hell difference, I cannot say. Impossible. I can say there is a gapping of infinity. Not heaven and hell. Heaven and hell conception is also material concept because heaven is there. Heaven is there, Atma. You can reach heaven. Heaven is within the material limit. But I cannot speak that way. So this love affair, a practical love affair is so inner meaning. So, Mahaprabhu is sold. Mahaprabhu is sold in front of Jagadananda. Mahaprabhu himself told, I am not making. Mahaprabhu already told in Chaitanya Charitamit you can find. Krishna Das Kavira Goswami writing, Mahaprabhu is sold in front of Gadadhar Pandit, Mahaprabhu is sold in front of in front of Jagadananda Pandit, Mahaprabhu is sold in front of Gadadhar Pandit, Mahaprabhu is sold in front of, you know, Damodar Pandit. Damodar Pandit, I can speak this Siddhanta Vichar on Gaurpurnim day. Not now. Because all related to gold lila. Now. So, there is one turbulent, you know, like in water you can find some turbulent, you know. You know. <coughs> triangular, <coughs> triangular, you know, current there, you know, plane. If you, if you have a plane flying up there, then you can go down. It's one kind of turbulent, current. Shh. Not only current, turbulent means rotating, going down, pulling. So the Prem Vivartha, so nice. And one thing, 
for your kind information. For your kind information, I would like to speak. Don't forget. You have to remember whole life. Birth after birth. There is written that if somebody going to follow Prem Vibhartha, surely he is going to get Prema. Affirmation, confirmation. Confirmation. It is written. Those who are going to follow Prem Vibhartha, surely can get. Of course from heart. Under the guidance of pure Guru Bhishra. You can take the book, oh, and nothing speciality, Maharaj, I read. Not that. Under the guidance of pure Guru Bhishra. If you read, if you understand, that Prem Vibhartha itself can give you Prem, Krishna Prema, which is rare for Brahma Sankar. You can remember someday, long before, someday I told, you can remember someday, long before, someday, long before I told you, that only Parthana Prem Mukti Chandika. Parthana, we know, Narthamudha go writing two books of Kirtan. Very small book. Our Gaurakishwar Bhavaji Maharaj, our Gaurakishwar Bhavaji Maharaj used to read this Parthana Prem, no bag, nothing. Only two books. Very small book, very small. Like notebook, small notebook. So our Gaurakishwar Bhavaji Maharaj used to keep always, always, always used to keep these two books, Parthana Prem Bhakti. I can, I can put guarantee in Vyasasana. If you understand, if I understand, Parthana Prem Bhakti Chandika, I need not go to any. It is the gist of Chaitanya Bhagavad. It is the gist of Chaitanya Charitamrita. It is the gist of Bhagavatam. Follow what I say. Unique. Only by following, only, 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 only. Only by following, only by following, only by following Parthana Prembhakti Chandika, I put challenge in front of you. You can get the lotus feet of Gauranga. But you cannot. Why? You have no faith. You cannot follow properly. Guaranteed. It is guaranteed. You cannot. Parthana Pemmukti. So. So what wrong in it? It is written there. Parthana Pemmukti Jandika about that. I told you. About Jagadana Pani, very small book, very small book, one small tear tries, very small book. If you understand Pem Vivartha, you can get success. You can get success. So, whenever, now I like to proceed further, whenever something, some problem happening, whenever some problem, a problem in, some fighting with Mahaprabhu. Whenever some problem happening, in between problem always happening. No, you do. No, I don't like that. going. Out. Oh, you hear? No, I don't like to hear you. In between always going on. One day, Jagadananda thinking, my Prabhu is a taken sannyas, sleeping on ground, and is all in a very slim figure, all you know. All, you know, bone going to touch with the ground, cannot sleep properly. Well, I can make one mattress and everything proper. <laughs> I can make one mattress. He is going to make one mattress, very nice mattress. Very nice mattress. And pillow, everything. I'm going to give to Govinda. I make this. Prabhu sleeping, cannot sleep properly. So you give this to Prabhu. When Jagadananda wanted to request, when Jagadananda wanted to request Mahaprabhu through, when Jagadananda wanted to request Mahaprabhu through Govindo to accept the oil to apply on head, Mahaprabhu became very angry. Yeah, Jagadananda bring this oil for me. Well, he can also hire one message man. Mahaprabhu speaking. <laughs> Mahaprabhu speaking. Jagadananda only. Jagadananda only bring oil 
not sufficient. He can hire one message man. He can assist hold my body with fire. That is why, that is why I am taking sannyas. That is why I am taking sannyas. Somebody can message while in my body. That is why I take sannyas. You speak. Follow. Follow. This way. So all is fighting going on. When he is going to make one mattress and everything, pillow giving to Jag our Govindo. Jagadanda thought at least he can accept it. Jagadanda thought, Jagadanda thought, maybe Mahaprabhu can accept him, at least this can. But when Govinda speaking, Mahaprabhu going to sleep. Sleep means Mahaprabhu not sleeping, whole day Sankirtan. Someday, Govinda making one nice bed. Mahaprabhu with this bed, who bring? So nice pillow, he <laughs> said. Jagadananda big. Jagadananda bring? Eh? Jagadananda bring. If you don't accept, you become very angry. Yes. That is why I have taken sannyas. I can use pillow. I can use mattress. <coughs> that is why I have taken sannyas. Very good. After making, you know, before making mattress, Jagadananda collecting white cloth and you know making it in a you know in a you know red color i mean sannyasi saffron color so that mahaprabhu can accept it is all saffron color all you know cotton everything all inside cotton inside and outside all you know saffron color so jagadana thought mahaprabhu must be must be accepting but Mahaprabhu became angry. That is why I have taken sanya to use pillow, to you know mattress. Very good, Jagadanda. Mahaprabhu get up. Throw, throw. Jagadanda became very, very angry again. So angry that Mahaprabhu cannot control him. So angry. Finally, Sharup Gosai laughing. Sharup Gosai know everything. Sarup Gosai requests a Pandit, hear me. Pandit, hear me. I can, I find some solution. I find some solution. Prabhu, Prabhu can accept it. What? You can do one thing. You can, you can collect all, you know, banana tree leaf, banana leaf. You can collect all huge banana leaf. And you sit, banana leaf with knife. You can make banana leaf very fine cut. Banana leaf is there, no? You can tear, tear, banana leaf, you know, tear. You can collect all banana. But what will happen? I suggest you, Prabhu can accept. You collect all banana tree. After banana tree, dry banana tree. After that, it's going to tear up all leaf and making like, like you know, cotton. And going to put, is going to make one mattress, you know, outside, you know, structure. I mean, with, you know, you know, with cloth, after that, going to put all inside, inside that, you know, hollow, hollow, hollow cloth, you know, structure there. Like pillow. Outside there is cotton, there. Yes. Outside, you know, one, you know, cloth, and inside cotton there. So, Jagadanda gradually putting all inside that, you know, mattress and pillow. And after that, everybody going to request Prabhu. If now you are going to ignore, then Jagadanda can leave body. What do you mean to say? Somehow he, he put so much labor. He is putting all dry leaf, you know, banana inside this, you know. And you make it. Please accept. Then by the request of Sarup Gosai Ravanda, finally going to accept. But still Jagadanda is not happy. Still Jagadanda is not happy. Then Jagadanda, Still Jagadananda not happy. Jagadananda going to take permission from Mahaprabhu. Yesterday I told na, you give permission, I go to Vrindavan to take that. Actually, Vrindavan Darshan is not big issue. He became angry. He liked to go away from Prabhu. Vrindavan Darshan not big issue. He is not foolish. In front of Mahaprabhu, Vrindavan, you give me permission, I like to go to Vrindavan Darshan. Mahaprabhu not giving permission. 
Because Mahaprabhu know it very well. If one hour, no one fraction of a second going from me, he can start crying. Mahaprabhu not giving birth. Mahaprabhu speaking, you become angry and like to leave my association. I know I cannot give you permission. No, I am not angry with you. You give me permission, I like to go. I never see Vindavan. No, I cannot give permission to you. Mahaprabhu not giving permission. Not giving permission for a long time. After though he is going to pursue Raya Ramananda, <laughs> Sarup Dharup Damodar, and Sarvam Vardhi, you, you please, you know, Prabhu not giving me permission. In my whole life I never give, see Vindavan, please, you know. Well, we can request for you. Then finally, they are all going to request Prabhu, one time you like to take Darshan of why not you give permission? After repeated request, okay, if you like to go, can go, what I can do? You would like to go, I can go. Prabhu giving permission. It's not willingly. Unwilling. Not willingly. Unwilling give permission. Okay, go. After that, he is going there. I yesterday told na. Whenever Jagananda is taking permission from Mahapu to go away, that time his heart started vibration. I'm going away from gold. But still, Prabhu giving permission, you can go. Then Mahaprabhu giving some instruction. Yesterday I already told Jagadananda, you are going to Vrindavan. You can remember some point. It is my advice to you. You can go to Vrindavan, but immediately come back. Don't stay there. Because you cannot you cannot understand the strange, you cannot understand the strange behavior of Brajavasis. You can make mistake. So better you can come back quickly. And another point. Every fraction of second, you will have to stay with Sanatana Goswai. Sanatana Goswai, I am speaking, Mahapu speaking. Sanatana Goswai, I am speaking, Mahapu speaking. Every fraction of second, you will have to, you know, stay with Sanatana. Every fraction of second, you will have to stay with Sanatana. If you do 84 cross parikram or Govardhan parikram or any pilgrimage, any, jag any deity darshan, or taking bath in Jamuna, wherever you go, you'll have to go with Sanatan. Every fraction of second, you'll have to stay with Sanatan. Not even a fraction, not even a fraction of second, you can leave the association of Sanatan. It is my request to you. You promise me. Well, Jadun Jagadanda agree. Yesterday I wanted to clarify this point, why Mahaprabhu wanted to give advice to Jagadananda. Jagadananda is not a small boy, that Jagadananda can stay in the lap of Sanatana. Jagadananda is not, Jagadananda is not a small boy, that Sanatana can keep in lap and oh, oh, oh my son, not that. Why? Then there is some purpose. Why? There is some purpose. What is the purpose? Mahaprabhu wanted to give, Mahaprabhu wanted to indicate to all, you know, Gauriya devotees, all Gauriya devotees, that Sanatan is Sammandagyan Acharya. All Dhamma Darshan, anything, any Bhajan, anything whatever, without Sammandagyan Acharya, all failure. I can clarify this point. Tomorrow, the sloka I started with, now no time, excuse me. Now no time. So the sloka I started with, I can explain tomorrow, I think, because today time can. Eh? I can speak tomorrow, and tomorrow also I can try to clarify more about Dhamtatta. Then I can go and show you that Jagadananda Lila, how nice, how beautiful, all Lila. Lila with, you know. Sangsaru Sindhu Uttarane Hidayam Jadi Shad Shankirtanam Ritarase Ramate Manoschet Premam Budhu Biharane Jadi Chitta Bhitti Chaitanya Chanda Charane Kurutanuragam Chaitanya Chanda Charane Kurutanuragam Vancha Kalpaturu Sikhe Pasindhu Bhavacha Patitanam Pavana Bhavishna Bhyona so try to do bhajan, ah, you are doing parikram, everything. 
And in Parikrama book, I can show you. Bhakti Mantra writing. Even in Kartik Mas, you can do Parikrama. Let's read it. Kartik Mas is very special for Parikrama. Bhakti Mantra writing. Before Bhakti Mantra came, but very special in Kartik Mas. Bhakti Mantra writing in Parikrama. 